mining rig. I can now see what the part number of the power supply is, and I'll get a spare for that guy. 1200 watts. This will supply power to the cards exclusively. Uh, separate ATX power supply mounted here for the main board, storage, etc. It was obviously put together in a hurry, but it's not in really bad shape. Uh, the screw downs for the cards were a bit stripped out in a couple areas, but that can be remedied. Overall, very good quality for a rig. It's about as pro as it gets. Um, I'll look into the model of these extenders and see if there's anything better out there that might give an edge, but these are likely good to go. All the cables were included. SATA power for the extenders, and it uses SATA 3 cables for the card slots. It's not SATA 3, that was just the most convenient cable to use for the extension, so they've adapted that PCI 1X into the slots. Looks like there is a voltmeter status reading on the uh, power distribution panel. Uh, these, these are server power supplies, so they must have had a bulk of these for cheap, otherwise you wouldn't be able to get a 1200 watt power supply for that price. Uh, total cost of the rig for me was uh, about 380 390 via eBay, uh, including postage, and it uh, took nearly a month to obtain, and they were backed up on construction of these. It was shipped in two pieces, and I just pounded the uh, top onto the bottom. Very nice choice of uh, angle plastic pieces. They've, are, they've put the post down for the main board. Cross rails are riveted. Not real happy with what they did with the uh, card power supply though. <clears throat> it's a little bit elevated on one side and all that's holding it on this end is a uh, cable tie. And there should have been another one more crossbar here to support this but a little ghetto but it's good. I may adapt something and improve upon it but uh, just judging by the parts alone, I quickly could see that the parts alone were at least uh, 250, 275 uh, for this. So I was more than happy to pay for the labor and uh, an all-in package rather than have to get all the individual components for this. So should be good to go. Get a spare power supply because these are non-standard. Um, in emergency, though, one can hook up a standard power supply and just lay it there. But it's a good fit here, and we'll get to building.